Hello everyone, welcome back. In this tutorial, I will show you how to make a logo animation for your brand or YouTube channel or any video product. So let's get to the very place here. So let's get the tutorial before start the tutorial. Make sure that you have subscribed to my channel and like this video. So now open your after effects, go to confirmation, create new confirmation and name it domain. And using 1920 pixel by 1080 pixel and 30 frame rate per second duration 10 second. And I chose background color is black. If you go if you want, then hit OK. Now let's import your logo. Go to file and import file. Select your logo and click import. Now you can rename it. Click folder and name it your logo. This is the logo to this folder and drag the logo to this main composition. Press S to open scale and adjust the logo size. Now select the logo and right click in your mouse. Go to K Composite. Select the name logo comp and Select move to all attributes and hit OK. Now go to effect and paste it in such for Vegas. Apply it to the logo comp. Go to the image controls and select the channel to alpha. Segment change to 1. And select band mode to transparent. Select the weight 10, hardness 1, midpoint opacity 1, midpoint position 1. Now go to the first term and create a keyframe to the length, make it 0, go to around full frame. and make it to 1 <coughs> you can see this kind of animation here now go to shape layer and double click here to create a shape the pro rectangle one, rectangle path, and decrease the size something like this. Now again, go to the table place it and search for turbine space. Apply it to the shape layer and change the complexity size to. Ctrl D to duplicate this effect and change the complexity to 5. Now 
now back to fast frame select the shape layer and drag it in this direction here back to the fast frame and select the shape layer press P to open position we need to take the frame here around 3 seconds and drag it here okay. now select both of the keyframe right click on your mouse and make it easier go to the graph editor select both of the keyframe and make it like this okay. Ok, we can the smooth layer Go to a technical set and search for first color Apply to the transition layer and change the run to Again, search school levels Apply And change the input like to 160 and then put white to 195 now click on now back to the process and drag the logo from here and select the logo blending with to stencil alpha you will find an animation like this Now click on to it and we need to log the animation. Right click on your mouse, go to me, create new solid, then white, and then we need it to PG for background. Place it below the logo animation. Go to effect and preset. Subscribe to apply to the logo animation and again go for CC light swap light. Find something like this. Go to here and create a keyframe to the center and go here like this to this. You'll find a reflection like this.
now press Control D to duplicate it. Delete the mode effect from the below layer and again go to the effect and search for the demand for apply it to this below layer and change its blending to screen Group the thing okay. Now search for drop shadow. Apply to this log animation. and cancel the setting okay Now select the DT layer and go to the clean set and search for gradient plan. Apply it to the DT. Select gradient to the RAM, soft color, drag it to the center and blank this you can change this color to your own I'm going with this color okay. Now right click on the mouse, go to new and create new camera I'm going to hit 50mm Hit OK Now select the unified camera tool and make it something like this before that make the logo animation a decompose make it to final animation and make it 3d okay now we can find something like this Okay. Go to first frame, select the camera, press P to open position, create a key frame here. Go to around 3 seconds. 
okay now drag them like this like this Now you can see that we select both of the keyframes. Select this keyframe, right click on your mouse and make it easy again and make it to this is now go for around 5 seconds. Press counter and white bracket key to put it here now right click drag this point to 5 seconds and trim comp area now our animation is ready let's see the preview I hope you like this video. If you like this video, make sure you that you like subscribe my channel and share this video with your friends. And please give us thumbs up on this video. Thanks for watching. Now let's render it. Before render it, you need to add a audio if you want. To add a audio, just go to import file and go to folder where you locate the audio select the audio and click import and drag the audio to this composition area after that go to composition add to render view to render the file now click on the output modules or loose list Select this to quick time and if you have an audio, turn it on. Select the audio for it to ASC. Then hit OK. Now select out this folder. Save. Now just click on this render button. So this is the tutorial. I will make this video. Like this video and give a thumbs up and share this video with the channel. And share with you with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel.